is there a specific question that visa interview officer is like thinking that i'm this is the question i want to see how they're going to perform and then based on that i'll reject or is it like overall like have they already made up their mind on the first question <laughs> Before we dive into all the strategies and stories that we're going to discuss in this podcast, let me ask you this. Do you have a clear job hunting strategy to get an internship or a full-time job? Most people don't and it's costing them opportunities. I've helped over 1100 students with their strategies through my ultimate job hunting course. And trust me, I'm not even kidding. I could see so many recruiters viewing my profile. And it's been the best investment I've ever made. The content is incredibly practical, filled with tips and strategies that make you stand out to recruiters. Uh, it was one of the best courses that I have done till date. This course covers everything that you need to stand out. You will get ultimate resume course, you will get ultimate LinkedIn course, networking strategy, access to 1100 plus job seekers for support and personal support from me through WhatsApp group. I will walk you through every single step that you need with real examples and the tools that will give you an edge i don't want you to miss any other opportunity to land your next job or an internship so check the link in the description and now i will let you enjoy the podcast is there a specific question that visa interview officer is like thinking that i'm this is the question i want to see how they're going to perform and then based on that I'll reject or is it like overall like have they already made up their mind on the first question <laughs> or and if they have then will they just continue on or if they have not then like I'm just curious to like understand the psychology <laughs> of how they are thinking question by question. So we've talked about this in other videos. I had to adjudicate 120 visas in a three and a half hour span. I wanted to get you out of my window as fast as possible. So your visa interview was very quick, probably because you impressed them from the very first thing that you said. Similarly, if you say something that is completely a rehearsed answer that is unimpressive, the consular officer may reject you right away because in my experience and in their experience, once somebody is on a script, it's really hard for them to get off a script. Mm. So the concert officer almost gives up on you. It's like, I'm going to this university because it's the most ranked university, the best in the world. And I'm going to go see Dr. Professor X. The concert officer is like, I don't have time to suss out the real answer here. This person can't even give me anything to work with. I'm going to refuse them. You know, so um, that's not for everyone, but, you know, say that, they may or they may, may ask you really quickly about your finances and again that answer is also short it doesn't really give very strong finances you're maybe you're giving a one word answer um and in that case now you're zero for two and yeah, yeah. The concert officer yeah. needs to move on right yeah so in so it's the story that matters the most it sounds like it from uh from like overall answer 